day and welcome to test tube today I would like to talk about an emotion that we are all experiencing and this is about fear fear with a capital F diba? Natatakot tayo. we fear that we might get the COVID-19 virus and get sick we fear that our children or our spouse or our parents will 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 catch it and we will get very ill or even to the point of losing them pwede mangyari ito pero pwede rin namang hindi paano natin lalabanan ang ating takot <laughs> sa pamagitan ng pagtitiwala kung ako rin po Takot na takot ako, sobrang takot ako dahil itong si Robin na anak ko at ang kanyang partner na si John ay nakatira po sa New York City. At alam naman natin, napakalungkot, libo-libo na ang namatay sa New York ng dahil dito sa COVID-19. Paano ko nilalabanan ang aking takot? Pinalalakas ko ang loob ko sapagkat nagtitiwala ako. I trust, I trust that Robin and John can take care of themselves I trust that they are observing the strict quarantine and I trust that God will protect them. When in doubt, trust. Ulitin ko lang po. When in doubt, trust. Let go and let God. You know, three years ago, I had to face a most frightening challenge in my life. And this was the right and left hip replacement of my body. Mahaba pong storya, basta kinailangan, sapagkat I was in so much pain, and if I did not undergo that, I will be chained to a wheelchair. My good doctors, Dr. Liagogo and Dr. Kabatan, recommended uh, that this surgery be done one hip up after another in one session. Yes, one session in four hours. Mabigat na decision, but I had my complete trust in them because I know that they will take care of me and that I know that I will be fine. Ayan po. Labanan po natin ang ating takot. At alam niyo pala, nung ako po ay nasa stretcher na at dinadala na papunta sa operating room, Ang prayer ni St. Patrick na binigay po sa akin ni Sister Hazel ng Central House ang nagpalakas sa loob ko. At ito po ay inuulit-ulit ko. Pwede niyo po akong sabayan kung kayo po ay may takot ngayon sa inyong mga dibdib. Christ with me. Christ before me. Christ behind me. Christ in me. Christ beneath me. Christ above me. Christ on my right, Christ on my left. Christ when I lie down, Christ when I sit down, Christ when I arise. Christ in the heart of every man who thinks of me. Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me. Christ in every eye that sees me. Christ in every ear that hears me. I arise today. Through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief of the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the Creator of creation. Labanan natin ang ating takot. Magtiwala tayo sa Kanya. At lagi po tayong magdasal. Hindi-hindi niya tayo pababayaan. Maraming salamat po. Ingat tayong lahat.